Hi, I'm Irfan. In this video, I will share how to make Tibu Krabby in Inkscape. So, we're going to create a text effect like a sheet of book paper. I made this illustration inspired by scrolling YouTube. Then I tried to apply it in Inkscape, and it worked. Here, we only use interpolate and play with gradient colors to add a realistic impression. Okay, you can see the final design result here, like this. And here, you can open your Inkscape. And then, click new document. Okay, here I create um, a rectangle object like this with a uh, black color and here I resize for width, we fill with number 1500 and hit with 1502. Okay, here I tap on um, text draw and for fun we use uh, Oswald and click a bolt and here I click a key icon and always for width we fill with number 530 okay duplicate and change this text we fill with text freely and resize we fill under number 530 okay and then here I create a rectangle and then with mm, sorry uh, with no fill and activate stroke pin enable stroke pin and for width we fill number 2 pixel okay you can change the width 180 and 530 click this object pad object to pad click edit pad by nodes and this you select this, this node and you can move like this with shift and arrow key and this node too okay duplicate this object and move this object like this click flip selected object horizontally here yeah. okay here i click uh, draw and rotate like this click pad object to pad ungroup and union okay click open pad effects click plus icon here i type um perspective and click and then here I enable snapping um, edit pad you can drag this point to rectangle object to make it to make a uh, to make it a look a uh, perspective effect okay And then you can click freely, uh, rotate, um, object to pad, ungroup, and pad union. Uh, click pad effect, click plus icon, click perspective, and you can add it like this. can drag this point to the, the rectangle object to make it look perspective effect okay you can delete this object the stroke object and the stroke object 
object to path okay you can and then you can mm, move this text object like this and here I change the color to white and then you can here I create a like a sheet of a book here I create a gradient color on this point we fill a uh, black color and you can edit gradient like this okay here I um, duplicate this object and then uh, for width we fill number 90 like this and then you can use a line and distribute like click this icon okay click this object and you can move like this with shift with arrow key okay click extension general from path interpolate for interpolation step we fill number two and you can click left preview and click apply click close and then you can ungroup this object and you can click this object and click um right selection to top Click the freely object and then give a gradient color like this. Here I use a gradient color before. Okay, duplicate this object and uh, resize for width with a number 90 pixels. Okay, you can use align and distribute and you can move this object like this with save arrow key. Okay, here I I did the gradient color manually. And then you can click this object and this object click extraction general from red interpolate and you can click left preview click apply and click close here i um ungroup this object and this object and click uh, this icon okay you can move like this and next here i edit the gradient color manually at um sorry here I edited the edit the gradient color to make it uh, look more realistic. Okay, click this point. Okay, and this point you can move to make it look more realistic and uh, upon the freely text object here i edit manually like this mm, sorry okay yeah you can drag like this i did the point of gradient color like this okay i'm sorry uh, yeah yeah you can work you can move like this okay hmm okay yeah
Okay, finally we have we finished the sheet of paper like text effect in Inkscape. I hope you can make it too. If you have any question, you can uh, submit them in the comments column below. Thanks for watching this video and see you in the next video.